Uh, good morning and welcome back to the Drummond Channel. It's Wednesday morning, July 5th. Hope everybody had a, a wonderful 4th of July weekend. And what I'd like to do is, is take a look again at the Euro. I'll put a forecast out on Friday indicating that we might be setting up for a triple dot push to the upside. And let's see what the, the weekend of uh, unrest and uh, some bad economic data coming out. Let's see what it's done to this forecast. What I was looking at on Friday was this monthly bar closing up on top of its peel dot. And that would be the weekly peel dot coming in this week at the monthly peel dot. And then just down below that is the quarterly peel dot. And uh, we can see on the daily chart on the next the next chart that uh, we also have daily peel dot in this area. So there's a lot of support in this area and anticipating that that support was going to start to push up and we're going to see a yearly PL dot refresh. Uh, and I should say it's a little early. We have to see how prices na navigate this monthly envelope top and this quarterly envelope top. But, uh, you know, the, the longer term picture is, you know, quite possibly we're looking at a uh, yearly PL dot refresh. Now over here on the right on the weekly chart, you can see how this is beginning to show that this forecast uh, may not work out. And right now we're pushing down below monthly and weekly PL dots. And if that continues, we have a weekly envelope bottom and then things really get uh, lower down here at the quarterly PL dot and the uh, monthly envelope bottom. Now, so far on the daily and the, and the hourly, these lower time periods haven't given us much information. Daily PL dot is snaking sideways, but there was, uh, you know, low volume, uh, low trading on Monday and Tuesday. So we're, we're going to be waiting to see how uh, this market negotiates this PL dot on the daily chart and perhaps uh, the maybe closing up above or holding below the weekly and monthly. Looking at the hourly, uh, there's not a whole lot to glean from this. It's hourly congestion. Uh, this this is the, the 10 o'clock bar, 11 o'clock bar here. So I'm, I'm going to be waiting to see how uh, this market negotiates this daily PL dot and I'm not going to be doing anything until I see this climb back above there. So I guess, I guess the selling point for all this is that there's a lot of turmoil out there called causality or external, external factors. And there's also the, the drum and geometry forecast and they're at odds right now. And this is a good time when there isn't a clear signal, uh, when the chart isn't telling me that this, uh, support area is holding, uh, it's time to stand aside and, and uh, wait for a little bit more information. So that's it for this quick video. If you have any questions, please let me know and uh, we'll see you again soon.